Good morning, my name is Lisa. I'm the district sales lead in Oklahoma. And today I'm going to show you how to do a safety sweep. So when you first arrive at the store, whether somebody is there before you or not, everybody should be doing a safety sweep. You're gonna catch something that somebody else didn't catch. So you're gonna make sure that you walk up and down every set of tables, looking for tripping hazards, safety issues, leaning tables, sticking out bars, just anything that could possibly potentially cause you harm while you are working hose reels plastic and you want to make sure that you walk up and down get a full look of your whole table and blocks and anything like that this is what we call mowing the lawn because you go up and back up and back so as you can see we don't really have any safety issues out here on the apron So and you're gonna go all the way across your apron looking for stuff, stuff like that. So you can see we've got a hose reel out here. The hose is wound up, it's behind the gate and tucked away out of the way so that is not a safety hazard to anybody. And then when you walk into the store, you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna walk up and down the aisleways, but you're gonna go all the way to the back because you work this whole entire area. There should be a caution wet floor sign out here somewhere because the floor is wet and it is a slipping hazard. So you're going to make sure you take a photo of that and upload it to your Movista M plan. You want to walk through. And everything's looking good. Here you can see we've got some blocks that need some straightening. So what we'll do is we'll put that on our safety plan, our safety walk. And then we will also get our kickstand and we'll straighten those blocks up so it's no longer a safety issue for us. We're all the way down here to the end and you can see we store our empty racks back here. So this forklift sitting here without the flags on the forks is a tripping hazard. So we make sure we take a photo of that as well and include that in your end plan. And we walk back the other way. They've got this weird pallet display to go around the light post. And those pallets stick out. That is a safety hazard because you can catch your leg on it. You can catch a rack on it. Customers can get hung up on it. So we want to make sure you load that to the safety plan as well. If you have time, you should actually tear it down because that is not how we build tables. So things like that. Um, you want to look to see if there's any hose reels out. If there's any hose reels out, you want to make sure that we've got caution signs out there because the hose is a tripping hazard. Um, and just making sure that you document everything. When you are working, make sure you are aware of your surroundings. It's not just stuff that's on the ground. You want to look for hazards up here as well when you're hanging bars. Are any of your Y-frames loose or hung upside down where they're going to fall down if you put too much weight on them? Something else that you're going to look for, a lot of the stores have these hose reels. They can be potentially harmful to you if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. As you can see, that uh, is right in front of our table. So when you're merchandising this part of the table, this can get in your way. These stick out and they, you can get caught on those as well. So make sure that you're documenting all of that kind of stuff for your safety. So that is how you do a quick safety sweep. Make sure you're completing that daily every time you arrive to your store.